Okay, I got these uh, police handcuffs. We're gonna see if you can break loose by shooting at them. And uh, I'm only gonna shoot them with the nine millimeter. I assume most of the cops will probably either carry a nine millimeter or a 40 caliber. But in a case if a bad guy was to get a hold of a gun from an officer, can he break loose by shooting these handcuffs? Handcuffs? <laughs> Cups. <laughs> we'll find out right now. So, Jasperi, how do we do this? Easy. Watch. No, let me do it like this. No, watch. Like this. Okay. Tie this one and you shoot here. No, but I want to shoot first the chain and then I'll do the. Uh, yeah, you part. can uh, shoot the chain over there. I think we're going just for the chain part, right? Because if somebody was to uh, try to free from these, they won't be shooting this part here. They'll shoot the chain. So let's shoot the chain. Okay, cool. Duct tape. You know what, Jeff, buddy? What? I should also go like this. So this thing doesn't move. Oh, what happened? Or, let me just handcuff you, you hold them like this up and I shoot between your hands. Yeah. That's a good, good idea. Good idea. <laughs> <laughs> That's also a good idea. Okay. We'll be using a Glock 19X and I assume most cops will probably be carrying a hollow point but I went with the full metal jacket instead um, just because I think it'll be better in penetrating so and sometimes what they'll do is they'll put a full metal jacket and a hollow point both of them in the magazine so that's also a possibility but we'll just go with the full metal jacket I know some people are going to say, well, you should have done a hollow point, but uh, we'll skip that. That's pretty ready? I'm ready! Here we go. <laughs> I don't think I hit it. No, let's go back. Boop, 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 boop. Ready, just buddy? I'm ready. Clear. I feel, I feel like it keeps going past it and it's pushing it out of the way and it's going hitting the cinder block. Okay. Uh, let me shoot it a few more times. <laughs> yeah, see, I was right. It's hitting it right over here, right over there, but it did not break it loose. Even it hit over here, Jasper, look, it didn't break it. Oh, it's not, it's not sliding through anymore. And that one is open. Yeah, this one is open. Okay, it broke this one. I broke this one. This one is not working, but it hit the chain right over there. Wait, 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 let me let me this, let me zoom this thing. Yeah. Nada. Let's go. <laughs> what is going on? Oh, you know what? I have been hitting it. Look, Jasper. I just hit this thing. Yeah, I've been hitting it, I guess. It's just not doing anything to it. Look how bent it is. So it's hitting the chain right over here. I don't know if it shows on the camera, but it is not cutting it. Okay, well, let's keep going and shooting it more. Maybe it'll cut it open. I don't know. Let's see. No, move, move. The, yeah. Okay, let's go. Ready? Ready! I'm ready!
Nope. Let's go one more time. <laughs> Nada. It keeps bending more and more. Look at that. Wow. These are some tough handcuffs. What do we do? Do we stop? One more. No more? Yeah, that's it. Oh, you got it. Oh. Uh, okay, let me see one more time. <laughs> nope, it just keeps bending. Wow. These are some really tough handcuffs. So these handcuffs are made by Smith & Wesson. Model M100. Good job, guys. <laughs> okay, let's do it one more time, Jasperi. Last time, that's it. No more. You ready? I'm ready. That hit me in my head. Okay, we are clear. Oh yeah, I hit it dead on. Hit it right over there. Look how bent it is. But these chains are not breaking loose. Wow, amazing. This part still works though. This one doesn't. It's out. I'm gonna go to the 4D caliber since a lot of cops also use the 4D caliber. This is from uh, this is from Federal, it's 135 grain, it's the Hydroshock one. And I've heard cops actually use this round. And we're gonna use the Glock 23. That's where you're recording? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's a yes. I mean, of course. Of course. <laughs> okay, ready? I'm ready! It looks like it hit, but it did not cut it in half. Okay, one more time. Round two. Nope, keeps bending more. You can tell. It's hitting it, but it's not cutting it. Okay, one more. Let's shoot it from a little bit closer. Okay, just watch your... Go back if you want a little bit because that concrete is flying back. Go back and then zoom it in. You good? <laughs> Clear. Oh, well, you know what? We didn't hit the um, we didn't hit the chain, but we hit the the handcuffs and it stopped the bullet. It stopped the 40 caliber. It is hollow point, but still that's kind of cool that actually this thing can stop it. Nine didn't do it, and look how bent it is. I don't know if the camera sees it over there. Put it against my shirt because it's got a white background. Can you see it? Yeah. It's pretty bent, but it did not break loose. Let's try it with a different gun. Okay. When it all fails, bring out the shotgun. This is also one of the weapons that you can find in most car cops. And uh, we're gonna shoot it up close. I'm afraid that thing is gonna fly back and hit me, the concrete. So just kind of go back again a little bit. I'm just gonna do it up close. Don't worry about me, I'll make it. I'm bulletproof. <laughs> no, cabron. What? You go back. I'll be fine. Okay, let me go aim it a little bit up. Are you ready? I'm ready! Oh, and I'm using a slug. <laughs> okay, I guess <laughs> I guess I didn't really hit it exactly where I was supposed to. It hit right in this area here. 
But that's pretty good that it didn't cut it in half, even at that location. Okay, let's shoot it one more time. <laughs> okay, here we go. Oh, that did it. <laughs> yeah, it cut the thing in half. No. The chain survived. You hit the... Here. Yeah. Well, that's because I was aiming a little bit lower, so... But it still managed to bust it open. Look at this. Oh, wow. <laughs> so I did hit the, uh, this area, I guess. It bust open this thing and it made that uh, little loop fall out of it. Okay, we're just gonna go for the chain. You ready, Jasperi? Ready! Go back a little bit. I don't know, I give up. I think I hit it a little bit on the bottom. And it's not tied down, so it's hard to just hit the chain by itself. But the shotgun always does the job. One time we shot a chain, right? The thicker one, it went right through it. Okay, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and as always, thank you for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Clear.